Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Hannah. And today I thought we would just share some of my personal favorites this past January, but also just the past few months. I feel like I haven't posted one of these in a while. So it's kind of a summary of a few months into one. So I have a lot of stuff to share. So let's just get right into it. Let's start off with beauty. I The first favorite that I have been loving are these hair clips from Dry Bar. I got them for Christmas, but they're from Ulta. And I originally had the smaller little just hair beauty clips. I don't know if you know what I'm talking about. I'll put a picture right here. But I have a lot of hair and a thick hair, so those just kept just easily falling down. They never stayed in place and they just wouldn't do what I wanted them to do, which is keep my hair out of my face while I'll do my skincare and do my makeup. But because of these being so big, they really hold my hair up, which I have been loving and using them every single day. And also I like to do my hair before I do my makeup. So these kind of help keep my hair in place while my makeup I'm doing my makeup so I don't have to like pin it back or put a clip in it and it kind of ruins what I just did on my hair. So yeah, these have been a go-to of mine, such a staple. So if you have thick hair or a lot of hair, long hair like I do, or the other ones just aren't working on your hair, try these because they're a lot thicker and like bigger so they can, I don't know, go back further. They just work. They work a lot better, I think. Another favorite of mine is the Osei Body Care. This brand has been such a treat, honestly. Every time I get out of the shower, every time I go to bed, it's just such a spa night for me and I love it. Especially in the colder months, my skin definitely gets a little dry. My hands are honestly dry right now. I might put some of this lotion on, but I tried this brand first in the fall because I've just been hearing so many good things about them. And I was like, okay, I need to give this brand a go because I really like the ingredients and I've just been seeing so many people just rave about them. So I was influenced originally into buying these, but since then I have repurchased and I'm just loving them so much. The Body Balm, or the body butter is just so nice, so thick. It feels so good on your skin. I like to keep this in my nightstand or on my nightstand to just lather up right before I go to bed just to keep that moisture in so I wake up feeling really moisturized and hopefully not dry. And then after the shower, I like to keep these in my bathroom and then after shower, I love to put the oil on because a lot of people have been telling me that oil helps moisturize and help dry Skin better than like a lotion and then I'll put the lotion on over top but yeah it's just been a bit of heaven I've been really into body care and just like self-love at night and that has just been a really big go-to of mine they smell so good like like I just feel like I just stepped into a spa just putting that lotion on so highly recommend trying that out it is pricey but honestly I don't know it just it's so worth it, I think. I love it. Another favorite of mine is perfume, and this is a new favorite. I have never been the person to love perfume. I haven't been the person that, you know, has a day perfume, a night perfume, a special occasion perfume, or just like a bunch of perfumes. I've always wanted to be that person, but I just never liked the smell of perfumes. I just have never found one that really I'm drawn to and I feel like everybody else is drawn to a certain perfume that they just love. And I just have never been that person. Until a year ago, I was shopping with my cousins and we went to, into a store and I discovered this brand, which is the Mason Louis Marie brand. I guess they're a perfume brand. And I used the number four. And it's just like a little roller and this was like the perfect start for me personally because it was so easy it wasn't like anything strong it wasn't anything like intimidating with like a spray or anything like that and i have just been loving this and i just never looked at the website i don't think because this has been like lasted me so long because i don't put it on 
regularly. I literally just put it on if I'm like going out to dinner or something fancy to be honest. So I have not like been on the website to repurchase it. But this past Christmas, I wanted to put it on my gift guide for you guys. And I realized that they have a spray, which is probably kind of, I don't know, stupid of me that I didn't think that they would have a spray version or a bigger version than this little oil. But when I saw the spray, I was like, okay, I feel like I need to try this out. I can finally have a perfume that sits on my little stand and I can spray it on and I feel a little girly and a little like I don't know nice when I spray it and I got it for Christmas and I am obsessed it's in the same scent number four and it's heaven I just feel like I don't know feel like a little I feel girly and I love it and it makes me feel good and when I put it on so that has been a favorite of mine and I've just been loving to spray the perfume when I go out to dinner or something fancy and it makes me feel good. So that has been a favorite. Another favorite has been this hair clip, solely for the fact that I just am obsessed with the color and I just feel like it adds to my outfit. That might sound weird, but this is just such a gorgeous color. It's in this beautiful wine color. It's from J. Crew, very reasonable. And I just, I'm obsessed with it. I just feel like it gives me a little pop of color, but not doing too much. And it's just beautiful. It holds my hair really nicely too, so it's good quality. I have it, my sister has it, and we just love the color. So that is that. Simple, easy, just obsessed with the color of that hair clip. Another beauty favorite is the Claudier Beauty Elixir Spray. This stuff is amazing. I don't know what is in this stuff, but I feel like it just makes my makeup sit so much better, feel so much dewier, just Honestly, I don't feel complete without spraying this on. This is my second purchase of this and I just can't get enough of it. I spray it on before I do my makeup and after I do my makeup and I just love it. I spray it on my brushes when I am putting product on my face and I just feel like it seeps into my face really nicely and it's just amazing. So highly recommend. This is not a setting spray, but to me, I use it as a setting spray and I've been in love with it. My last beauty product that I've been loving is my lip treatments or lip tints. I love the Summer Fridays and the Road. The Road I have in, I have it in the regular, but honestly I love the regular of the Summer Fridays better. But I recently tried out the Tinted Road and I am in love with this one. I've never been like a lip person. I slowly, I feel like I'm becoming maybe one not like a like full-blown like loves a dark lip or whatever but I just like a little bit of color on my lip recently and I feel like this is the perfect shade I have it on now and it's nothing too out there but it just kind of ties my makeup in and I totally forgot to bring down the lip liner that I use with it but I feel like a lip liner totally changes the game and I feel like that's where I went wrong before. I never used to use a lip liner. So I just felt like the color that I would use just didn't light on nicely because I didn't have an outline for it. It's truly an art, to be honest. And I've just been loving the color Toast. I just feel like it looks so good, so natural. And yeah, I've been loving this when I go out to dinner or I don't know, go, go out with friends, whatever. Just love this. And then the Summer Fridays, just the clear ones, I've been loving this. I keep one in my purse, one by my nightstand, and I've just been using this every single day because my lips need it in the cold months. It honestly, my lips have not been chapped once this winter, and I feel like it's because I've been religiously putting this on, and I feel like it's been helping it so much. So I have been swearing by this. I always have one on me. Wherever I go, I can't go without it and it just feels so good. Moving on to clothing, let's move on to fashion. The first fashion favorite is a pair of socks actually, and it is the J. Crew cashmere socks. They are superior to any sock that I own. I want so many more pairs of them. I love them. I never really got the love for cashmere socks because I've never owned a pair until these, they just keep my feet so warm and they just feel so good, I'm obsessed. I am in love and I want another pair. They are 
amazing. I get so sad when I wear them just because I know I can't wear them like the next day because then they'll be dirty. So I am constantly washing them because I constantly want to wear them because they feel so good. I need to get another pair to be honest, but I'm just in love with them. Another thing that I have been wearing all the time since buying it on Black Friday is this Lisette cardigan top. I just mentioned this in my haul and it has just been one of those tops that I am just constantly going for. Makes getting dressed in the morning just so easy because I just know it will look good. I know it will be comfortable and I just can always count on it. So it's been becoming part of my like daily wear, whether I put a tee underneath of it, whether I don't, I just love this so much. It's so comfortable and I love the little buttons and the pattern on the cardigan. It's just amazing. I have been living in that. Another favorite that I've been loving is this scarf from Quince. Quince is such a good brand. I actually, my mom discovered it like last year and it has been such a fan favorite of mine because it has really good staples for a really affordable price. And I asked for this uh, scarf for Christmas and I just love the thin scarf. I don't really have a thin scarf and I love that I can wear it out to dinner or whatever and it's not so big and bulky and I can kind of just, sometimes I just don't even take it off and it becomes part of my outfit because it's so, it's not, it doesn't get in the way is what I'm trying to say and it's so soft so comfortable I love the heather gray color and I think it's a really affordable price for a good cashmere scarf I want to say I want to say it's like $50 I might be totally wrong but I'll have it linked down below another favorite of mine is this Lauren Magnugian cardigan I got for Christmas I have been living in this and <laughs> recently I saw that somebody uh commented on my last video saying I can't believe you got a $600 uh, cardigan as a loungy robe and yes I am totally aware that it is an investment but don't worry I don't just wear it as a loungy robe I might have said that in the video but I wear it as a jacket too I wear it non-stop what I was kind of hinting at is that I wear it throughout the day outside with my outfits but then when I come home I keep it on all throughout the night because it just feels like a blanket. So it has so many different uses and it's so versatile and I just live in it, literally live in it. It's kind of bad, but not really because I definitely get my money's worth. It is just heaven in a sweater. I am just so in love with it. It makes me feel so comfy, so cozy. It's just the perfect cardigan for everyday wear. And I think I wore it every single day this past week. I'm not kidding. So I do, I wear it all the time. So don't worry, I am getting my money's worth. I wouldn't pay that much money. Well, it was actually a gift, but if it was my own money, I wouldn't pay that much money for a robe. So don't worry. It is a jacket and a cardigan that I wear out with outfits as well. Another favorite of mine has been these Levi jeans that I got on Black Friday and I am obsessed with these. These are so comfortable. I have been just going for these more than I have my still here jeans, which is crazy to say and for that to come out of my mouth, but they're just so comfy. Like I just can't get enough of them. I want another wash. I love them. I love the dark blue, but I think I want like a uh, true black they have a really pretty true black on their website so I'm definitely looking at those but when I say these are probably the most comfortable pair of jeans I truly mean it and they're such a good price so definitely if you're on the hunt for a pair of jeans highly recommend these I do think that you should size down and these are 24 and I'm usually a 25 so I size down one but yeah and I think my sister got them for Christmas and she had to size down as well so highly recommend these. I just, I just love them. I can't get enough of them. They're so comfy. They're the perfect straight leg. They wear very well. Like they get a little bit looser, but like the good loose where it like looks good and more of a like baggy straight leg. And then when you wash them, they're more of a form fitted straight leg, but they wear really well. I just, I'm obsessed as you can tell. 
Another favorite, this is not really like fashion, but I guess fashion, I don't know, is that Adenola workout sets. I feel like I mentioned this a while ago, my favorites, but I have to mention it again because honestly, I wear these every single day to work out, go to boxing. They are just becoming my favorite workout sets ever. And they're such a good price for workout sets. I love them. This is actually a new one that I recently just got. And I love the sports bra. I love the double strap. It just adds a little bit of uniqueness to your workout set. And then it has a kind of V overlap on the waist for the leggings. And I actually got this in the longer size, I think, or longer length. And I kind of like the longer length and the shorter length, even though I'm not that tall. I just like how it goes like I don't know I like longer leggings I like when they go to like my ankle or past my ankle so I feel like these really do that and they just they're just the best honestly if you want a good workout set I highly recommend checking out Adenola they fit so well they're so buttery they stay in place they hug you in the right places they're just so good Another favorite of mine is pajama sets. I have been really into pajama sets recently. I just want to totally like get rid of all my pajamas that aren't sets and just buy new pajama sets. I'm not gonna do that obviously because that would be not practical or not financially smart of me to do right now. But I'm just obsessed with pajama sets. I cannot get enough of them. This is a new one from Skims in this buttery white color and I just love it. I get it in a size small and I just wear them all the time. I, yeah, pajama sets of me are just like this right now. I know it just makes me feel so like luxurious when I have a pajama set on. I just love it. Another favorite are my two bags. The first one being my new one that I just got from Modern Weaving. I have to include this. It has to be a favorite because I've been wanting it for that long. I just love it. I love the straps. I just love how like the leather moves and how it wears. It's just so soft. I This is like my everyday bag right now. I have all my stuff in it. It is just so good. I want like another one, which is bad, but I do. And then another favorite of mine, and I think this is a favorite because of the Lauren Manugian cardigan, is my crossbody purse that I got last year for Christmas and I feel like I wore it so much that I kind of got sick of wearing it and I switched it up when I got that furla bag but I like that the way this looks over top of my cardigan and it fits really nicely and it lays really nicely and I like that I can obviously have my hands as well so I've been wearing this a lot recently with my Lauren Magnugian cardigan and I just love the pairing together it's just been a go-to of mine so this is coming back as one of my staple bags as again i feel like that's all my fashion favorites moving on to just like random favorites that i've been loving one is the higher dose sauna blanket i don't have it it's, it's upstairs my sister got it and that thing is heaven i've always known the benefits of sauna like sitting in an infrared sauna is so good but not only is it good for your, like obviously your body but your mind like when i lay in that it has totally calmed me down relaxed me i like fall asleep sometimes not really but like i feel like i can because it's so relaxing to lay in that and i just get such a good sweat i personally don't sweat easily and it's such it's so good to sweat it's not good to not sweat so it's not a good thing that i don't sweat easily and I truly just love sitting in there and just sweating because I don't feel that a lot and it's just been such a nice thing to have, nice thing that my sister got and that I am able to use. It's I've been using it pretty much every single day. It's so easy. I just lay in there for like 15, 30 minutes, watch a TV show and I just feel so refreshed afterwards. It has been totally like another form of therapy like boxing is for me just to sit and kind of just like my mind, like ease my mind and lay in it and just relax. So the sauna blanket, obsessed with. I know the higher dose one is probably the most expensive one, but there are so many that I've seen that are honestly reasonable in price because 
and such a good investment because honestly, I have paid to go sit in a sauna and it's so expensive. So you end up paying like for your sauna sessions as much as you would if you just bought a sauna blanket. I eventually, my dream would be like to have like a whole sauna, like infrared sauna in my house one day, but that is like so far down the line. But this sauna blanket has been so good. I'm so lucky that she got it because I'm, I'm in love with it. Another favorite of mine has been the probiotic. Now I am not a doctor. This is just has worked for me. I just want to state that. It's just a personal favorite. I, I know I've tried probiotics in the past that hasn't worked for me and works for other people. So just take this with a grain of salt. But the Ritual Symbiotic Probiotic, Prebiotic, and Postbiotic has been a life changer for me. It truly has helped me so much. And I, since I just moved to, um, house, this actually was sent to my old one. So I didn't have it for a few days and I could totally see the change in my body not having, not taking it for like five days because I didn't have a way to go get it. And I have now been on it for like the past three days and I feel back to normal again. So this literally is a life changer for me. I am obsessed with it. It is the only prebiotic that I've tried that has worked for me personally. Not saying it will work for you, but for me personally. And I feel like it helps my skin. I, it helps my digestive system. It helps my bloating. It helps like everything. It helps my like daily, you know, movement. You know what I'm talking about? It's just amazing. My next favorite is actually to do with my Stanley cup and it's this little, topper at on my straw and this has been a game changer for me because I have actually always thought like I wish I had like a thing to close my straw up because sometimes it spills or when it like falls I don't want it to spill so I've always thought of having a topper but I never could find one and then I was at the gym one day walking on the treadmill and this person came up to me and actually my Stanley cup fell and spilled right before she came up to me and she was like is that your Stanley cup and I was like yeah she goes well I actually just started a new business selling Stanley cup toppers that I have designed and made because I have been really wanting one and I couldn't find one out in the market and I'm like oh my gosh so she actually gave me a bunch because I said I would share them with you guys because I just feel like I mean everybody has been loving their Stanley cup and these toppers are just so smart they're so simple and I love the simplicity of the design. I'm not one to have like something big so it's literally like you can't even see that it's there. And I just like that I'm able to close it because honestly she has pictures on her Instagram of like bugs crawling down your straw which now is terrifying to me. So just being able to close it up is just like a peace of mind and it's just so smart. So, and it's so easily to wash. You just throw it in your washer or you throw it in your dishwasher, wash it, etc. And it's amazing. And she has so many different colors. So definitely go check her out because she was the sweetest human ever. And they're so reasonable price. I think one, oh, I think one is like $4, but you can also buy like 10 for $11, which is incredible and she has all the colors of like the stanley cup so if you have like an orange stanley she has like orange for your topper or she has blue or pink and or white or black and i just have the clear but obviously i have she gave me so many different ones i've actually been giving them out to people that i know that has stanley cups because it's just such a smart idea and who doesn't want a little like cap for their straw when they're out and about and set their Stanley cup down. It's just so smart. So this has been a favorite. I've been keeping this on every single day and I use my Stanley cup religiously. So yeah, I'll have everything linked down below for that. She was just so kind, so sweet. So just go check her out. I feel like, I wish I got that out for Christmas cause I feel like that's such a good Christmas like stocking stuffer is those Stanley tips, but Honestly, for birthdays or honestly, it's just such a smart idea and reasonable price that just buy it for yourself. Gift yourself a little cap for your Stanley straw. I love it. Another favorite of mine, and this is a recent favorite, is the Nowhere Bakery baking mix. 
I actually got the cookies for my sister's birthday in December. Her birthday is December 11th. And I ordered like the actual cookies for her birthday because she is dairy free and we've been seeing these everywhere and have always wanted to try them. But they're obviously in LA so we don't get them in like our grocery stores here. And then I just realized she started selling the baking mix on Amazon and I ordered two and I actually made the first one a few days ago and it is just so good and so yummy and so healthy that it makes like eating a sweet treat or dessert at night not feel so terrible or just feel like you can eat one every night and it's totally fine and I just love how the ingredients, I don't know if you can see, but the ingredients are so good like you can obviously read every single ingredient and all you need to add is almond butter maple syrup and vanilla extract <coughs> to it and it's plant-based no gluten handmade no refined sugar no dairy no soy and paleo so literally know of everything and these are the best cookies ever so if you have been on the hunt for good healthy cookies and easy to make with this baking mix and it's on Amazon, so easy. There's also sugar cook. She has her sugar cookie baking mix on Amazon as well. But I personally like chocolate chips, so I've been living for that. And it's just been such an easy go-to of mine because I definitely am a person that has a sweet tooth. My entire family has a sweet tooth, and I just need something at night. So having one of those cookies, still feeling like I'm putting like good ingredients in my body, has just been really nice and I've been loving it so that's everything that has that's all my favorites all my favorites for these past few months and January I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in my next one bye love you